Hello, and welcome to another episode of The Cooking Professor. So today, um, I was talking to my granddaughter, Chef Skyler and Chef Salem, and they were thinking about what would be a great um, dinner recipe for the weekend that we could do. And so I told them, I said, let's try to make a homemade pizza. All right, so our ingredients are, we have mild Italian sausage, we have pizza blend cheese, we have our pepperonis here, we have our provolone cheese, we have our purple onion, our peppers, and our marinara sauce. And of course, this is gonna be our crust. We're gonna make an upside down pizza in this cash down frying pan, okay? Um, with our grains. So the first thing we're gonna do is, we are going to put our sauce down inside of this. Let's see, can I open it up? All right, we'll be right back. So first, we're gonna put our we're gonna base our marinara sauce here. We're gonna put this in. Okay, well that's the base of it there, okay? All right. We have that. And so, we're gonna go with, we're gonna go with some cheese first. This is our, we got the pizza blend. I'm gonna use some of this. Okay, we got the pizza blend. All right, okay, so we're gonna just sprinkle some over here like this. All right, so this is just the beginning now. This is just the beginning, so we have that. So now, I'm gonna stop for just a moment. I may even, I'm gonna go ahead and put some pepperoni. We'll do some pepperoni. Pepperoni here. Oh, that didn't cut out well. Let me try it again. Her chef Scowl and Chef Saver really don't like pepperoni, but I told him I said, "What's a pizza without pepperoni?" So I told him we see how to, we're going to use the pepperonis. Okay. So let's just place them down here. And I've already preheated my oven to 350. We're just gonna add some of this goodness here. Placing it. Cause pizza has always been fun to eat, right? Pizza is fun to eat. So we're gonna come back to this and I'm gonna just let these pieces sit right now. And then we're gonna do, we're gonna do our pepper. But I am, I'm gonna go ahead and put some green peppers here. We got the colors coming in. I'm gonna put some green peppers in there. All right. Okay, we're gonna come back for our next step. Ready? Yes. Okay, so now I'm gonna go and we're gonna go ahead and get our mild Italian sausage. I'm gonna cook that over here on the stove. So you can join me there. Okay. All right, so this is our Italian sausage. So we're gonna let this cook. And I'm gonna add a little bit of seasoning in here, not much. Just a little bit of season. Okay. Sausage. We're going to go ahead and take this off the heat. Okay. 
but Purple onions, they get a piece of taste, and so you can always take them all. Chef Scal and Chef Sable, why not like purple onions? <laughs> I'm not gonna put green up there, cause they don't, they're not fond of purple onions. Okay, but it's okay. All right, all right. So now we have that layer. Okay, now we're gonna put some provolone cheese up there. I got this open here. Yeah. I'm going to open this. Okay, I'm going to come over there in just a minute, Sky. I wanted to have so I wouldn't have this. Okay, so. All right, guys, so now I'm going to do the provolone cheese. Okay. And I'm going to do the provolone cheese. There we go. Okay. Here we go. All right, so we're going to cover this. Okay. Now, let's go back with... Sausage over there. Spread this over here like so. And so I put some oregano, basil. On this level here, okay. All right, I'm gonna put make another level. Let's go ahead. We're gonna put our peppers, and we're going to do our pepperoni. And so really, when you make a piece of like this, you can make it your own, however you want it, because you're designing it, so you can put as how much of whatever item you like the best on your pizza. Okay, so now I'm gonna come back with another, well, marinara sauce. Spread it over evenly. Another layer of marinara sauce and see here. And sprinkle our cheese. More cheese. So now we're going to add some more marinara. This. Okay, spread it out. All right, let's go ahead. We're going to put just a few more pepperonis and then we'll do our sausage.
Okay, now, let's see, we're gonna do the rest of our sausage here. We're gonna put this right in the center. Put all the sausage, the mild Italian sausage, we're gonna put this in the center. Spread it out just a little bit there. Yes. Okay. Last but not least, we're gonna draw on some peppers from the side here. Just a little bit. All right. Let's put this provolone on the top. Put our cheese in the center. Go back. And I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna slice one provolone sheet down here. And let's close it like this. I'm gonna put some like this, okay? And let's go with our, let's go with our cheese. That's the top. Now, we have to close it up because this is an upside down piece. So what we're gonna do, now we're gonna make our crust to go over top. Stay tuned. All right, we are back. So I'm gonna use the Grand Crescent Rose as our crust, okay? So I'm gonna un untake this off camera and then I'll be right back. All right, so now we're back. And so now we're gonna put our crust on the top. So what I'm gonna do here is Okay, we'll just lay it almost like a piece, okay? So I'm probably going to make sure that I put, I'm going to go back and try to grease the pan a little bit more with some butter. Oh, for just a minute. So we won't have to worry about it sticking. Guys, I'm going to take a little bit of butter. And so I'll put that around the sides because we don't want to get this stick here. back behind this and I'm gonna put the butter there so And you just overlap it like that. So all everything is covered. Chef Scott was saying we weren't gonna have enough. Chef Sailor, did you think we were gonna have enough? Yeah. Now this is eight, cause you get eight. This is the big ones here.
And then whatever on the chip end that you can kind of cover up the holes there. To make sure it looks like a pie. Fill in the holes. No, I didn't run. Okay, so now we're going to put this in the oven and we're going to let it bake for a good 20 minutes, okay? All right. All right, so we're back now, and so it is like a five. You hear that crust? So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna slice it and we'll go from there. Straight slice. Okay, let's see here. We're gonna cut in here. It'll be like a pie. Oh my goodness, look at that. Okay, let's turn it this way. And we're going from the side. Ah. We're gonna go underneath. Underneath. Ooh, look at that, look at that, look at that. All right, let's go over here. Oh mm, my goodness, look at that. Okay. Now we do another slice. Mm. This piece here. Hmm, everything is just coming together. Look at that. Okay. There we go. All right. Okay, so we're going to have some taste testers going on here in just a few minutes, and we'll be right back. It's hot now. <laughs> Okay. Blow it. Blow it. Mmm. Is it good? Okay. Alright. I'll give it to you. Okay. Alright, so good deal. Okay. Mm. And that's Chef okay. Sayed Skyler. Mm-hmm. That's good? Okay. Okay, so let's see here. Mmm. Oh my goodness, this is good. Okay. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I certainly enjoy making it. Come back and see what the professor is cooking in the kitchen. Until next time, bon appetit. Bye-bye.